Oh, this is the cop we gotta worry about. Yeah, cause he came like he don't play games. He don't play no games. He can't yeah. Be either. They're sizing each other up right now. I was just thinking the same thing. <laughs> I'm nervous about Gouda because he seemed the type that actually try to go with this offer right here. Yeah, his brother just sitting there like, what this dude gonna say? He gonna take it, bro. My fault. Oh, that's a bar. Oh! oh! He didn't just blast oh him like God. that! He's crazy! He done lost his mind! Yo, nah, nah, nah. <laughs> He's the man! Oh my. Hey, look, he just took care of his problem. Like. But he had a truce, though, bro. <laughs> Nah, I, my fault, yo. Yeah, I'm really, I disrespected him. Oh my god. Gangsta, Evan. Nah, Broski really, Broski said you ain't gonna stand in front of me and say you gonna F my mom's, B. Like, yeah. here, before you get that word out, bro. Oh my god. Evan, gangsta, Evan. Yo. Yeah. Yo. Yo, he talking like this in front, in front of, of him. He's dead. <laughs> oh my god! You're right! He's literally talking to the cop yeah. while he's on the phone, bruh. <laughs> See ya. That was a crazy way to start that episode, bro. This show is so funny. Wow. I feel, I feel him, him. yeah. I do feel him. You liking this a little bit too much, bro. And I feel Bob was like, yeah, bro, I don't mind the fact you did it. It's more the fact you just did it without this dude's authority. Like, don't like don't just don't just do things free, Willie. What's good, man? We back on TTV, baby! What up, gang? And if it's your first time here, death won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash. smash. That subscribe button and welcome back to RTTV where we react to everything. Everything. And we back reacting to that Misa Paul, man. Last episode was crazy, man. We seen that Dippy's best friend, Gulu, she was going to be president. Well, she's going to... She's running to become the president. president for the college. And Muna did not like that whatsoever because he wants to be the person that's running the college. So through his act of vengeance, he went and kidnapped Dempy. It became a whole big car chase scene. But luckily, we was able to retrieve Dempy. But Muna wasn't feeling the way that his dad really came at him and stuff like that for like making that move right there. So he's spoiled brat, bro. He is. So he conspired with his best friend Compounder to, man, to try to kill his father. So they go try to make the attempt, but through that attempt, the dad was able to figure out that there was an assassination, assassination attempt. So he tied up the, his boy, questioned him about it, and his boy stayed solid. He ain't snitch, but then he forced Muna to have to kill his best friend. As you know, as a way to basically, you know, give him the punishment for trying to do that right there. Poetic justice. Yes, yeah, that's crazy. And then after that, we seen that Gouda, Guru, and Bablu got attacked by people from Jumpur. Mm -hmm. And from that whole incident, it was a quite wild ass action scene. They felt, Akanda felt it was best that they went to a remote city so they can, you know, lie down, lay low, and stuff like that until things cool down. But. 
That boy Gouda was not listening. He went and started selling those guns still. And then from that, he was able to attract the attention from the leader of Jampor. And he made it a, a deal with him. Well, he, he gave an offer. He said, hey, listen, come work for me and you will get way more respect than you ever could get in Mizapur. Because you can't trust a Akanda because he's the type of person that will, will shake you out of your boots and double cross you when he needs to, you know. Mm-hmm. Exactly. So we're going to see if they actually bite at this offer or they're going to stay loyal to the people that put them in a position of power. So... Remember, guys, if you guys want to get the full uncut reaction, it'll be up ahead, super early access when it comes to this show right here and a lot more. Make sure you check out our Patreon. The link is right down below. But let's get into this episode of Mizapur, episode 8. Kandav. Why you just talk to yourself? Yeah, I don't get it. <laughs> I'm so mad at you. I'm going to talk to other people to talk to you. <laughs> not trusting you. Yeah, yeah. I'm not looking at you. Don't talk to me. You said, Bina Pucha, no work. But Nia Ji, we're telling you the truth. You're going to get out of here. You're going to get out of here. You're not going to get out of here. Yeah, shut your eyes. This is my, this is me. Leave me, shut up. Are you talking? Pura Mirja, Pura, we know about both of them. We've heard both of them from the beginning. आज अगर उनको हम ठोक दिए तो कम से कम आपका कोई नुकसान तो नहीं किया मुट्ठा ये नहीं Who's that? Oh, oh father. Oh. Damn, that's tough. He's OG. Yeah, you know serious if he had to pull up. आप <laughs> छोटी चीज के पहले परमिशन लेंगे तो काम कैसे करेंगे आप बताइए। हम्म mm. में आप तो इतना प्रॉफिट दे रहे हैं। He's talking तो down literally at all. पूछना जरूरी है। He's right. He is. I, it's it's tough though, bro. Oh no, that's, he's being sarcastic. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm.
Like, honestly, they're like their dad. Technically, yeah. like, when they're about a career, they're about it. They're, that's just I like you, bro. Like, just like you. Because his job became dangerous, and he still didn't bro, back down. And, and I might put a gun to my daughter's head, and I still ain't going to give him the answer. I don't know, bro. She's like, yeah, she's like, let's kill him. Yeah, yeah that's I'll basically what she said right yeah. there. <laughs> Make sure you actually get the job done, all right? Yeah. <sighs> oh. Damn. Ah, oh, damn. OG finna find out. Bagged up. It's crazy that OG is seeing everything, yeah. bro. This house is swarmed with snakes. Yeah, yeah, bro. He's watching like his son just getting strangled without even noticing. <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you, he's still this resentment, bro. <laughs> 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 nah, bro, he's, a hell he's a big ass dude. <laughs> Whoa, he's flexing on him though. He be wildin' when it comes to, to Kaleem, bro. He be trying to undermine him, yeah. I don't like that. I think you forget how to show his daughter, bro. He got it anyway, bro. It's like water on him, bro. That's nah. See what I said? It got there was gonna be repercussions, bro. Yeah. Damn. Nah, that's dumb, though. That's stupid, bro. That's just dumb. That's just mad stupid, bro. Like, you really believe that, though? Uh, everybody's reaction. He's about to bug, brother. So everybody knows he made the call, bro. Like clearly, he should have at least placed. Oh my gosh, he's still he's wild. <laughs> Oh my god. This dude's the Hulk. He's wild. Oh! Oh, he's gonna kill him, bro. <laughs> it's not his fault, Guru. Come on. Kill me, your own brother, bro. Now, that dude that took the, the trophy is an idiot, though. Once I see if, if everyone in the crowd is quiet like that, I ain't even going to. I got to go up nothing, bro. I'm good. I don't want to watch the award. Y'all got that, bro. Well, that's when he came to grab it. I ain't going to Yeah, I yeah, was like, I got that. Yeah, you got that, bro. No, nah, yeah. bro. I'm like, he already told you a time, and then the whole crowd, and you know he's a thug. <laughs> like, you get me? It's like, I don't even want the award. You should have known, like, he should at least play. If he didn't play, you already know it's fishing, bro. Like, yeah, no, that is crazy, I'm bro. like, I'm not going to risk my life. And he held the award up. Like, he just told you, bro, don't fuck. He's going to kill you. <laughs> Right time I to control them with my hands. No way. Right time I No way. Mon is a smart man. He's bro. smart. Nah, his dad's also dumb. Nah, his dad's an idiot, bro. Yeah, I don't yeah. think he's smart. I think the dad's just dumb. But that's the smartest thing he's done in the show thus exactly, far. Exactly, because they went according to plans. <laughs> The funny thing about this, bro, is like... Even if... But that's what I'm saying. It don't make sense. Because even... Let's say that I did have... Why would I trust my son still? Like, what did he do? Yeah, that made him deserve Because he didn't give position. the phone to the guy. Like, you get me? It's not like he came out. Here's the phone. Like, yeah, yeah. that's why I'm like... Did that... I don't know. But if he did do that, that would have been mad suspect, though. But... You know what I'm saying? Like, imagine, like, no, 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 him no, 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 and then all that, all no, that message just says so. that. The dude stole the phone from him and got that. That's more suspicious to me. Because he didn't why stole the phone from him. That, that like that's a spot that they used to hang out at all the time. That's his that's that's his grandma's spot. Like, but he heard him talking and the, the phone being there though. When he was talking on the phone, he was talking on the phone. He wasn't at the dispensary at that time. Nah, he's still at the house. He was still at the house. That's why this dude overheard a conversation and stuff like that. And that's what made him investigate 
more and stuff like that. No, but, really I, but, that, but that's yeah. what I'm saying. That, that Just hearing that little bit of that conversation, you knew how close that dude was to the other dude. I wouldn't have, like, I, you already know the son is iffy. That's why I'm like, I wouldn't have taken it. I wouldn't have said, I. Right, because they mess up, I'm putting it on. No, I wouldn't do that. No, I agree that, with that. I agree that's with that. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, like, yeah. That's why that portion of it is like the dad is moving on. Like, even from the phone, I would need more context. Because why wouldn't I think someone would have planted that on my top guys? Mm. Like, I would have thought that would have been a thought in my mind. Yeah. Maybe they're. Because the and two. Most name, people don't like them. Them two didn't even go together. Like, the. Uh, Compounder and him. Yeah, that's why, that's why I would have been like, yo, hold up. Somebody could be like, and then you magically found the phone, and then yeah. this. I'm like, yo, let's. This, this could also be a setup, is all I'm saying. And he didn't think of it at all. He's going off emotions right now. That's, that's what why. I'm saying. Because of that like, situation that happened in his episode. And that's what I'm saying. Like, the dad's an idiot. He's not a good, he's just not a good boss. Yeah, because, yeah he's not. He's not. Because even that, the 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 thing with um, Gouda is like, that whole scene shit, like, what did that really, like, the, teaching a lesson, I think it would have been better in another sense. That was just, you're just going to ruin the, the bodybuilding competition. Yeah, nah, that's true, though. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's not, it didn't really do, you just, Ruin it and everyone, got mad. <laughs> and my whole thing is it, it threw me up because everyone thought he was supposed to win. So that's even worse. Where it's like mm-hmm. people knew he won anyway. So yeah. it's like And then right before the announcement, he leaves. It, it makes obvious. it very obvious that he was the one that tampered with the decision and stuff, yeah. Yeah, and I'm like, that's why I'm like it's very emotional, it's like to to, to do this. Like I'm like, how much do you think these guys are gonna be on your side? Your son violated him, you came at his death. Like it's a lot, that's why like when you I forgot you were saying like yo yeah Uda is not it's not even respected I'm like yo bro does he re- like bro like you know what I'm saying the relationship was started so iffy that I can't even take when he does stuff like that as disrespect when the way the relationship started in the mm. first place because it wasn't by tr- it was like they violated his son and his son tried to get them back then he went to the like, you know what I'm saying yeah. our family started off with beef so that's I nice. think there would always be that 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 so, but Guder I don't Guder to me I feel like Guder just. He's on drugs. That's his problem, bro. He's, yeah, he's on, on drugs. Steroids. That's his problem. But he's honestly, mo- he honestly, bro, the way he be acting is so erratic that it's like, bro, my G, either you gotta go to mental institute, you gotta do something. Because, <laughs> bro, the fact that losing a me- a building thing means you go and mer- I'm pretty sure he killed that dude. He's damn near Go dead. and he's kill some dead. dude over taking first place and bug out almost beat your brother. Bro, you gotta go figure out that problem, bro. Because at the end of the day, I don't think he was really crazily wrong for murdering that dude. Cause the dude did really like, yo, come work for me, did it. Yeah. Bro, you try to violate my body, I, I handle my business. But like his other stuff, like, bro, his fuse is this short. And like he has to make very good decisions in in, in situations for uh Colleen. And he's like, it's not working like that. But I feel like killing people, like if he wasn't doing his job task, that wouldn't have happened, if you get what I'm saying. Wait. He's killing people even without the drugs, he's killing people. Yeah, he's right? tapped. Mm-hmm. No, no, I'm basically saying that's his job. So it just makes him more violent in his field. You, if you get, because you remember you were, the first time he killed somebody, he felt weird at first, but then after that he. Kind but of that's what I'm saying. It's his job to be violent, though. Yeah. Like yeah, to survive yeah, his job, he's he has to be yeah. violent, and that's why I'm saying it's the the steroids is just altering what he already is. Yeah, it's amplifying that. Yeah, because right he's here. already killing people. It's just he has no control of killing people. Mm-hmm. But like, if you take steroids, pretty much what I'm saying is if you take steroids like that, you're not gonna just ki- kill someone if you weren't already killing people. I really don't, I, I don't like how Kaleem went about, like, I know, like, you even said it too and stuff like that, like, the the way that he went about, like, reprimanding him, it was, I don't I don't think that was the smartest way of going about it. Like, I feel like he could have had a better dialogue with him in that moment where, like, Gouda, like, basically was saying that, like, yo, we hold the authority too and stuff like that. Like, if you, if we can't make decisions without the calling you every time and stuff like that, then how could we do our job? I feel like they could have had a better dialogue versus... All right, go on. It's a free world, and then doing this whole thing when it comes to the show right here. Like I feel like as a boss and a person that's really running me support, and also trying like seeing them eventually possibly could be the people that could like take the reins in the future. I feel like he could have gone about that better. I think it's because he's uh, he's high on his own. He thinks he's the real king. You know that's why when he was speaking with the officer, Colleen. Mm. Uh, the officer was like, yo, you're speaking as if you're the real king of me support. Like, mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're not. You're really not. And that's why I feel like he made. He even made a decision at the muscle building place to say, yeah, we're a free world. We all have authority, but mine's different. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, you you can make a decision to run for, mu- for the muscle competition, but I have the authority to say whether you win or lose. You yeah, because I'm the king. Yeah, exactly. Uh. I'm, I'm that person. Like, you think you might have authority or say when you want. No, it's me. I really run the show. Yeah. And I think that's really him. Him just thinking like he's the king and like high 
above everybody else. Word. You know what I'm saying? He's gonna I think he's gonna learn his lesson soon. And the decision he made to bring Muna into the family and, and bring the reins, I think that was That's his, the thing. I think that was his way of trying to bring um somebody closer and build like more of a team because right now like Guru and Bablu they're they're part of his team, but like yeah. it looks like they make they could deflect at any moment. Mm. At least if I bring my son closer, I feel like somebody is actually a part of my team. Yeah. Now, but I just feel like that logic if the begin like it's like you just completely forgot everything that just happened. Yeah, yeah, you know, you know what I'm saying. So with the dad, that's why I, I feel like that's still not good because it's like there's a reason why you picked those two over him in the first place. Yeah, and you finding that out didn't change why you didn't put him there in the first. That's yeah. why I said that dad is just moving like weird. Like he just because I ain't gonna lie to you. Part of me feels like this is my this is my thinking, but I honestly think the dad knows he's lying. Mm. Like I personally think he's he's actually checking Muna. Yeah, take because that don't make no sense why he'll just get. Yeah, you take control. You like you think I don't know it's you too? Like I feel like it, that. I feel like it, it could be that too. I I just know that like I under I could understand. I do think it's his like his king thing. Like why he he feels the way he feels with Muna and Babu. But I also think it's like, yo, if you made the mistake or or meant and murdered this man, we can get over that. What we can't get over is you looking at me in my face and saying. I make decisions, I'ma do this. Mm -hmm. Like, cause now it's like, oh, so you telling me I'm not the boss. I bet. And he, that's basically, what, that's what he's like, I bet. Yeah, you got it, you the boss. All right, cool, everybody the boss, cool. But, Keep it pushing. But I, that, Cause it, I think to him it was like, it was like, yo, all right, you did that. If you came to me, it was like my fault, or yo, I had to do it. But bro said, yeah, I had to do it. And then said, what you want me to do, call you all the time? Yeah. I'm the authority too. Like, oh. Oh, but that's shit. What I'm saying. That's, that, to me, that's, like, like, that's kid games, though, because like with Pat said, he should have just, like, if they're your muscle and they're your team, you, you just tell them they're straight up because he just did some, like, to me, it's like some girl stuff. That really was. Did. That really it's was, like, It's like, oh, you got me mad. All right, man, I'm going to just get you back in a, I'm going to not let you win your competition. Like, you know what I'm like? What yeah. boys moves, like, mm -hmm. shoot his girl. So, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, be his ass. Like, that's more like, oh, you think you tough? All right, man, you got it. Then four of his people come in and beat his ass. Like, that's not winning a muscle competition in front of people is like really kiddish. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? It's, it's petty. Like, that was mad petty. Yeah, that's, that's what it is. a personal shot, though, because we knew that. that How much that it means to him. Yeah. It meant so much but, to him that what he just but did. But we're in a violent world. That's what I'm saying. In a, in a violent world, that doesn't play, that doesn't do anything. That uh, just, no, you're just, no. you're just making an enemy. That's all you yeah, just picked up. But you, your muscle, you just made him go even crazy now. Like, yeah, that don't make no sense at all. And that's what I'm like, if I beat your ass, it would have kept you in check because yeah. you're gonna be like, ah, this just made you emotional, and now it's like, wait, you're playing with me, like, like now he might not really like that personal thing would make him not even listen to you. Where if you just beat his ass, or if you like, yo, I'm gonna kidnap your dad or something, it would have been like, ah, right, I'm, I'm, a, he really got authority. Now it's just like, nah, you're my enemy. Yeah, like you know what I'm saying, I don't, it, I don't think he's gonna respect well, him even more like, now. He is. I, I'll put it this way. I, I do think it's very interesting that he's sending his his son, who like. Bro, he, the son couldn't kill the dad. Like, you're sending him to go kill Good. Like, he's gonna lose. Like, yeah. and that's the thing too. I do think I, to a certain extent, I do think it, it's more important to unravel him because the gangster, sh like, he's good at that. Guda, bro, Guda, they kidnapped his sister. You see what he did? We strap up, we go murder these people. Like, yo, go kidnap his dad. He gonna go kill you, bro. But we're not. Like, you better that. be able to protect yourself. Right now, you know why? Do you know why I don't agree with that? Because if Good, if that dude was there, Guda would have fucked him up. What are you talking about? If the boss was there, no, no. The, the boss was there, and, and he, he, he knew he was passed. that he the was boss passed. did that. That's what I'm trying he to tell passed. you. It's like, Gouda's not like, he's not that dude to play like that with. That's what I'm saying. Like, no matter what you do, he he will just wild out. Yeah. And if he was there, he would attack the father. But like, easily. But you see him right now, like, I, yo, he's he's crying. Like, we are, he unraveled that man. Like, he made it like, like the only thing that before, before this gangster shit, the only thing he cared about was I'm gonna be Mr. Pop Child 2018. He said that since the beginning of the show. I don't think he unraveled him. He just made him crazy, yeah, bro. bro. Well, I don't know. Know. Like, like yeah, he's I un, think that he's was un, the thing that he came to no, he's, he's unhinged now, bro. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. He, 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 he wanted to get his frustration out on being someone's ass, and then he almost beat his brother. And his brother, he had to calm down his brother. And that just slowed, that made it where I can't take out my frustrations on Punching people because literally I almost hit my brother. Let me, yeah. I'm gonna cry. I'm That's like, what I'm saying. But I don't think he unraveled. I just I think, think he, I, I think that. I what's unraveling to you? Because unraveling means like just happened. He broke him down. Like no, he just so if you cry, I think, you, no. you got unraveled. No, because I think that like I right, so say my biggest thing. My biggest thing is to he's always been violent. He just something. was more violent. That's no. all like, he did when he was doing the whole show. He did everything. But it's he not does. about the violence I'm talking about. I'm not talking about the violence. I'm talking about like 
Bro, this is the thing that he cares about the most. Like, this is what he, as as a person, I don't think he cares. That. I don't think he cares about. So we don't. Think he cares so we can't. Bodybuilding. We gotta agree and disagree on that. Girl. We gotta agree and disagree on that. The girl is because you think he cares about that more than a girl. I do. Yeah, he didn't come the whole the show was that. Bro. Was yeah, he no, didn't have pleasure because he wanted so. So the whole show was him trying to be a bodybuilder. Yeah, no, no, I don't because I don't agree with that because the last the beginning was and then the rest of it. I was about to say even coming into I'm like yo, he barely even talks about bodybuilding. The reason why he even taking them steroids. So I know he's been taking the studies, but I'm saying, I think I don't think he cared. Like I don't think that's the main thing. I think he just wanted to win. I don't think he cared like to show people. But it wasn't like I love bodybuilding. Nah, I like you know, nah, yeah, the yeah, whole the whole show was yeah. his passion for bodybuilding. And it went yeah. away. That's what I'm saying. In the nah, beginning, didn't want, didn't to me, away. in the beginning, it did because we barely. No, the, right here it went no, away. Let's, let's, this let's, moment let's, right let's, here. Before we had this conversation, yeah. I was going to say this and I didn't say it. Uh-huh. But when I, when they brought the body, but I was really gonna say, yo. He really detached from bodybuilding a lot this at this season. In the beginning, when he was regular Buddha, yes. When he started becoming more gangster, he started getting girls and stuff. It, he took a lot of time away from bodybuilding. All the only thing, he still was talking about it. Though, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's fine. I'm saying in the beginning he was more into it until he started doing more of the stuff. He yeah. ended up getting mad. Like in the beginning, he wasn't a gangster. He wasn't working for nobody. Yes, yeah, so he, he had all the time home, to put into it. Out. He became a gangster, started murdering people, started doing trades, got a girl, cracked her, then got married. That's what I'm saying. He had a lot of other stuff that piled up, which just put it to the back. And that's what I'm saying in this episode. I feel like it's shown the the closer he was to being regular, the more I feel like he liked bodybuilding. Right now, it's just for the glory of, yo, I'm Gouda, look at me. But it wasn't like... I feel like that's the involved him. I, for me, I feel like that. I, 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 no, I, I get, I get what he's saying. I get there. what he's like, saying. It did the time for me. Because the like, thing is, in, in terms, like I'll say this: what you're right about is the fact that since he had to focus so much on being the muscle in the streets, he didn't have the time to put in into actually being a bodybuilder like he had before or something. And like then he used to talk so, about it, showed it so much, and that's why I'm like, I feel like him becoming angry was him moving way past the passion where it's just. The steroids is the cl- the only reference we had a lot moving on was just him taking steroids. It wasn't him in the gym. It wasn't him lifting nothing. It was just him taking steroids, and then you see him going crazy after him taking steroids. But the love of bodybuilding that I've been not see that for a minute in this. It was just him just taking steroids, and then right now, they, when's the first time you seen him with a shirt off? Wasn't it just now? Nah, he took a shirt off before. I never seen him flex. No, I, that's it the first time I seen him like that. Cause we all like he's big. You don't I remember? Never he seen, said, nah, did nah, you know he, he had a six pack? Nah, I ain't gonna lie. No. I, don't, I don't even. I think that was a body double. I ain't gonna lie. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, me too. No, yeah, that's that's how how I'm not saying he that. looked that diesel at that time. He never, was at the no, beginning no, of the show. No, he no, he never showed. You don't remember he used to look in the mirror and be doing all that shit. But yeah, he had a tank top. Oh yeah, he had a tank top. That's true. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I just remember him like looking at his body. He would have been showing us the dream of him fighting for the pack, and I'm like, bro, he never. This was just really for the glory of yo. I want to look good, like, but the passion, like, he's losing himself is what I'm saying, and this love of bodybuilding is his real self, and I feel like he's, the whole season showing him detaching away from the Gouda we know and becoming a monster, and I don't think that monster loves bodybuilding the same, like. Well, I'll tell you right now, it's definitely R.I.P. to that, that career, and yeah, that love and passion, right yeah, that's chopped. Now. But like, it's, it's done now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's definitely chopped it's right definitely now. But why is it chopped? Why would you feel like it's chopped, though? Because I it's feel It's a like, corrupt area. That's all I'm like, bro, it's like, you know what I'm saying? It's like it was run by corruption, and then they knew he's a killer when he even. I'm saying like I'm saying that like since this happened right here, I I know his his basic thought process of. Oh okay, I thought you mean like the bodybuilding people are not gonna let him back in. I no, like, I think he's not gonna care anymore about bodybuilding at all because now he's so enraged. You messed enraged. up his joint. You messed yeah, up his thing. He's so enraged it's now. Like if I got, I wanted to go to Super Bowl for my whole life, and then they che- the, they cheated me out. Like all right, bro, cool, bet. And I damn near I snapped at my brother. They try to kill the rest. Yeah, like <laughs> bro, he's. Chopped and like, I, you know, I can only imagine what's gonna happen next. The fact that now Muna is gonna, it's or supposed it to be the person to kill realize him. like nothing matters unless I'm the boss. Cause I could, no, that'll never happen again if I become the boss. I mean, that too. Cause he could, that's what I'm saying. Like, I still think like he, that's just gonna make him want more control. Cause this is like, oh, that just shows I didn't have control back. Mm-hmm. Now I'm gonna be the boss. And I like, I feel like he'll do another muscle competition. And he gotta wait, he gotta watch his back for Muna now. Muna got handed the got handed the, the brand new Glocky, bro. He about to go hard. Yo, and, handle this. Yeah, he said, yo, they came to me, they said they were two bodies, one soul. Why do we take them out together then? I was like, oh shit. Which is dumb. Cause I like he, he knows his son's not even like that. 
Like, that's the, that's what I that's what I don't get. That's what I just don't get. Like, bro, you have MacBook. MacBook is yeah. your guy. Yeah. MacBook, go handle why, it. That's why I think. I, that's why I think. And, I, and I think, you I might think, be right on that. I think yeah. it could be a trick. Because honestly, Google. that's dumb. Because I'm like, yo, bro, that, the seeing the phone or whatever, I'm not gonna just think. It's like your kid's yeah. not a gangster, yeah. and yeah. you go yeah. to your kid, sense. and you're yeah. a big gangster who has real gangsters, and you go to your kid and hit him a gun and go, go kill the gangsters that I have working for me that are way more gangster than you. But yo, if you do that, shit's yours, bro. Like what? I'm not saying. Basically, I'm sending my kid to possibly die, and I know he's not like that. So yeah. why am I doing that? To That's so sad. Yeah, bro. I'm saying. Buddha don't like him already, so yeah. it's not like it's, it's, he's a friend who yeah. would sneak him. And if I want, and if I wanted to, uh, if I wanted to freaking uh, get him killed, I don't know. It don't make sense to me. It just don't make sense. Yeah. That's not the person that I'm sending to go for kill what. Buddha. But I do think that he loved that girl more. And I think that's gonna be. To do like I think they're gonna do something to that girl like they're yeah. gonna kidnap her and Not that's sure. where you're gonna see Guru sure. like okay, remember the, um hit the Muna like Muna like that girl too yeah mm. yeah he loves sweetie mm. so that's why I'm like I, I just I don't know I just, that's I feel like I seen the love of that girl rise where the love of his his shit go go, go down and that's why I think she's the number one thing he loves. And that's the shit that would make him unravel. That 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 him unraveling is him not even fucking with his brother to me. Mm. It's like I'm so going like I don't want to talk to my brother like nothing like and I feel like his girl dying and like his you know what I'm saying could be where you know I'm playing that like I don't want no emotional attachment to anyone I love I'm gonna just be on some killer shit. It's, uh, it's a good episode. We all, but see, you do gotta kill both of them crazy. together though. I do agree with him on that because they the one thing I think he also realized yo is their loyalty is not to me. At the end of the day, they are going to be loyal to each other. Like mm-hmm. if I try to kill one of them, they're going to kill me. So at the end of the day, if I'm going to kill one, I gotta kill both. Cause if not, Guru's gonna come for me for his whole life, yeah. or Babu's gonna come to me till he dies. It doesn't yeah. matter. They're gonna Bob come for me. Babu's smart, so either or, or yeah. something like that's so out. Exactly. So it's like if I do take them out, yeah. you do gotta two. You gotta get both of them. You gotta get both of them. Crazy ass episode that's gonna lead to I know a ridiculously crazy season finale. Yeah. So if it's your first time here, death form be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash. Yeah. That subscribe button, man. It's your boy Patrick RT. It's your boy Wells, the anime king. It's your boy Rapsi RT. What up, it's your boy DC? And that settles to that the, the round table. table. Thank you guys for watching RTTV on YouTube. And if you love these heated debates and you want to be involved and you want more perspective, make sure you tune into the RTTV podcast. And if you want to be part of the conversation with us and the rest of our community, make sure you guys sign up for our Discord right now. Link in the description down below. Call up.